So you're afraid of leveraging technology in your nonprofit because you don't want it replacing the amazing people in your organization. What now? Let's go. Hey, welcome to today's Trust Raising Minute. I'm your host, Josh. This episode is inspired by an encounter I had a couple of years ago where a prospective nonprofit refused to leverage technology because they didn't want it replacing their people. They delivered the comment with so much conviction that I didn't know how to respond. Today, I'm gonna just jump right to the punchline. Technology should never replace people. Technology is a tool. That's it, that's all. Think about your auto mechanic. Follow me for a second, it'll be worth it. Who fixes your car? The mechanic? Or the wrench the mechanic uses? I mean, you'd never brag about the wrench that fixes your car. It's your mechanic. The wrench is just the mechanic's tool. Wrenches aren't taking mechanic jobs. And I bet you'd want your mechanic to have the best wrench they could so they could do their life's best work and so they don't ruin your car, right? So how does this apply to technology? What if your fear that technology, your wrench, will replace people is the wrong concern? What if the right concern is, do my people have the tools or the wrench they need to do their life's best work? That's a question. It's an important shift in perspective towards not just stewarding resources, but empowering people to do their life's best work and realizing exponential impact. Technology should never replace people. Just like your mechanic needs the best tool for the job, let technology be your people's best tool. Let's keep the convo going online and on social. If you know someone this video might encourage, it'd mean a lot if you shared it. I hope you're energized. I hope you're encouraged. You've got this. Be yourself and go change the world.